What's up guys, welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy VIII! In the last episode, we made it to uh, the underground level here. Squall and the team made it to Balaam, and we finally found Headmaster Sid, and he revealed to us his plan to save the garden from missiles is um, us going down to this basement level to figure out what this old bomb shelter is and if it has a mechanism that might save the garden from the missiles or protect us from the missiles. So that's why we're here, and we're going to try to figure that out. So. Um, we just flipped this switch that opened that lever over there. We're pretty far into this area, so we've got to be getting close. Um, there's just a save point we just had, so that denotes something something serious is probably going to happen here. Something ominous, am I right? So let's go check it out. Ew, what the hell did that thing just jump out of? Oil? Ugh. Okay, so it's for boss time. These are oil boils. These guys are weak to fire. They're also very powerful, so this is a tough boss battle. I'm going to go for the strategy of spamming limit breaks. Not going well so far. Oh, shit. And, of course, I get a four-minute duel. Or a four-second duel, which is really crap. And Zell got attacked. As you saw, I didn't see what damage those guys did, but I know it was a lot. So, we're going to be in trouble here. I don't think I can get off Burning Rave. Actually, I did think I got it off. Okay, um, Quistus will use... Uh, let's try out Micro Missiles. See if we can... Uh, Zil oh, yeah, he took about 300 damage from that thing, it looks like. At least, I think that's how much HP he had, was at. Alright, so, his thankfully, his Burning Rave attacks both enemies, though, so that's good. Let's go for Renzo Kukin, and let's hope for uh, a lot of hits here. Five, that's pretty crap. Okay, at least I got the uh, the extra special with it at the end. That's good. That's what really matters. Is that guy dead? Oh, no, he's not. Okay, let's go for Micro Missiles. We're just going to try to focus all on one guy, because two of these guys, not good. Why Quistus hit that guy with that, I will never know. Oh, the other one was dead. We did kill him. Wow. Okay, we might get out of this okay. Yeah, 262, that does quite a bit of damage. One, two, three, four. Wow, that was a very little amount of hits. Oh, but he's dead anyway, look at that. Well, we got quite lucky that uh, Quistus' micro missiles did so much. Okay, those guys weren't that bad. I'll also be honest with you guys, I just had a failed recording of this, and uh, it was literally a failed recording because I failed to record it. I recorded my voice, but I forgot to... I thought I hit capture, but I guess it just failed to capture. So I wasn't recording it Yeah, So thankfully, I make saves quite frequently. So, uh, yeah, the missiles could be here any second. We gotta go. So, um, but yeah, it's the reason I'm telling you this is because of my last battle with those guys that I just had. They, they did pretty good. They wiped the floor with me. Um, they ended up killing Zell and getting Squall down to, like, 100 HP. And then, the funny thing is, I decided not to heal because I thought I was too badass to heal. And then I got in this exact same battle afterwards where I fought these three guys and I couldn't run. So they started attacking me and they killed Squall. So, it didn't go too well. But I just, you know, healed it off. It wasn't a big deal. So, whatever. Anyways, uh, let's head down this. Looks like, yep, another freaking ladder. Motherfucking ladders, dude. And hopefully we'll be there soon. Let's check it out. Oh, wait, what's this? Cutscene? Oh, crap. More missile cutscenes. Those are a lot of missiles. I thought there were only three launchers at the base, and I thought they had, like, two missiles each. It didn't look like they shot this many. Oh, shit, they're already crossing the ocean. They're on their... That's Balam Island right there. Oh, my God, missiles have eyes? That's scary. Oh, God, we are out of time. I hope whatever's down this ladder is what's going to save us. And it, I hope it does save us. I hope it doesn't screw us. Uh, come on, guys, move it. If you only knew how close they were, is they'll get your butt out of my face. I like Zell's shoes. They kind of look like Nikes. I definitely approve of Zell's fashion choices, that's for sure. Whoa, looks... Oh, that's Squall. Looks like we're here. Oh, man, what the hell do we do now? Look at this thing. What is this? Looks like a bunch of gears. Hmm, interesting. Okay. I see a control panel. It's a very old control panel. Yeah, even Headmaster, even Sid doesn't know what to do. How am I supposed to know what to do here? 
Well, it looks like there's only one button. Let's press it. Or turn it, I guess. And nothing. Maybe one more turn? And nothing. Well, that was successful. What the heck are you doing? Do I look like I know what the fuck I'm doing? I don't know. What do you think I've been here before? Whoa, what the heck? What the heck? Uh... Maybe I did do it. Let's see. Oh, ominous music. Oh, hey, it's moving! Yeah, I knew it. I totally knew what I was doing. Okay, so we got it to work. The real question is, what exactly does this do? It looks like something big. Maybe surround the garden with a protective barrier? Dig us underground? I don't know. Uh, okay, we're raising. Our platform is raising. Oh, hey, it's Sid's office. What's going on, Sid? Uh, what? Oh, shit! Were we just brought through the floor of Headmaster Sid's office? That seems... Okay. What? Oh, hey, Sid. How you doing? Uh, oh, hey, look, our little spinny halo thing is doing something. That's good. Uh, what? Uh, Transformers, robots in disguise? Really? Is that what we're going with here? Transformers do sex machina? Uh, okay. Looks like we imploded missiles on ourselves, this looks like. I can't see what it did! They're incoming! Missiles incoming! Oh shit, dude, no! Were we too late? Did what we did, did it do anything? Oh no! Brace for impact! Oh, they're missing. Some of them are missing. Oh no, run! Are we moving? We're moving! Did we move fast enough? Look at that. Our ship is moving. Our halo is gravitating us. We did it! We survived the, the missiles! Woo! Yes! We did it! We're moving. We're in the. We're a. We're a plane. We're floating. We're moving. More like Transformers robot in. Robots in the skies. I. You know, like this guy. Never mind. This is. This was what the thing did, huh? That's. That is impressive for a bomb shelter. I guess. I don't see how moving is a bomb shelter. Oh man, this is awesome. I wonder what is going on outside. Squall, let's go check it out. Huh? Uh, you mean like leave, but we're in the sky. How exactly are we gonna... Okay. Let's go. Yeah, go down. This, this is an elevator here, I think? Okay. Sid, don't touch anything. Don't kill us, please. So how exactly do we control where we're gonna go? Exactly. Didn't really think that part through. Didn't really think any of this through, be honest. Alright, uh, how are we going to go check outside? Oh yeah, there actually is an observation deck on the second floor, that's right. I think that's where we're going. Okay. Well guys, we just saved all of your asses from being blown up, what do you think? What's going on? I was hiding for a while, now I see all this chaos. Man, I'm really scared. Uh, no, I'm not scared. Uh, okay. What's up, guy? What the hell is this? Nobody told us that thing could fly. Yeah, <laughs> Dude, I lived here for 18 years, and I didn't know it could fly. Like I said, Transformers, man. Robots in disguise. What's up, guy? The hell were we doing? Sitting around doing nothing while those things were coming at us? I tried to tell you guys, man. Missiles are on the way. But no, everybody wants to fight. Garden Master, Headmaster. Uh. Anyways, uh, if you brought Renoa with you on the Balam Garden Party here, then you will have an extra cutscene when you got to the observation deck here. It's pretty nice. I'll try to show it. I'll show it after this cutscene here. Maybe. Well, here it is. We're outside. Looks like we're still on the island. That's good. I mean, we know we can fly, or float at least, but can we... Oh man, look at this. We're moving. We're, we're humming, too. We're going pretty fast. Damn. 
but we our garden is right next to the ocean. That's kind of a problem. Does this thing float? Can we fly? Can we control it? Huh, I don't know. Anyway, yeah, so you get an extra cutscene here with Renault. I'll show it now. Okay, so that was the cutscene with Renoa. Pretty cool. I I remember seeing that cutscene a lot, so I must have usually brought Renoa with me here. But um, yeah, I wanted to bring Quistis because of her degenerator, and uh, Zell. I don't know why I decided to bring Zell with me. Probably just because of his awesome dialogue. Also, Duel is pretty good. So there's that. Do 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 do. What's up, Headmaster? Is there a problem? Squall, the controls aren't responding. I don't know what to do. So, why does it matter? We're going to crash into the town of Balam if we don't do something. Oh shit, no, Balam. Dude, I have to fight Ma Dinch there to get my Elnoil cards. Holy crap, man, this can't be happening. Uh, Squall, can you think of anything? Dude, how would I know? I know just about as much of this thing as you do. Guys, guys, how the f- Why me? Fuck, just press everything, Squall. Use the selfie tactic, use the selfie tactic. Whoa, what was that? Yes, what's happening? Really? I just mashed buttons and now we're turning? Okay. I'll take it. <whistles> Too close for comfort there. Yikes. Squall, you did it. Ha, we're gonna crash into the sea. Everybody, hold on to something. Oh shit, I don't think mashing buttons is gonna help us this time. Oh, we're gonna drown. We're all gonna drown. So we avoided getting blown up by missiles in the face, but... Instead, we drowned. Seems seems cool. Wait, wait a second. Were we floating? So not only can the garden fly, but it's buoyant. Okay, I'll take it. Whew! Squall, everyone, a job well done. I think the worst is behind us for now. Yeah, I'd say that. Avoided getting blown up by missiles. Slaughtering mass genocide of an entire town. And now we're a boat. We'll drift along for the time being until we figure out how to maneuver the garden. Yeah, let's just ignore the fact that we need to control this thing. Until we crash into the next island. Well, okay. So much for my room. Where am I going to change now? Ha ha ha. Oh, yeah, that's so funny. Uh, all our friends died. Almost got blown up by missiles. Crushed by an elevator. Like I said, mass genocide of a town. Drowned. But yeah, let's laugh it up. Let's have a good time. We're having a ball. We are chilling like villains. Well, that was interesting. We are alive, at least most of us. How long has it been since we started moving? Okay, so apparently all the monsters are gone. Speaking of that, what the hell was up with that Garden Master situation? Did that ever get resolved? Oh yeah, and of course, reporting to the guard, the headmaster, all of our goings on in timber and everything. He doesn't know about anything that happened there. Middle of nowhere, <laughs> man. I'm bored. You know, I, I totally agree with that. Yeah, I don't really like thinking too much. I mean, I like thinking obviously, but I don't like sitting around just thinking. Yeah, well, we know that Irvine said. When we were there that he felt like we sent him because we didn't care about him, but that's not true. We believed in them, I you know. Who is she? Why fire missiles at the garden? Is Cypher ever coming back? 
Oh, yeah. Get even. That's just so funny, because we are the ones who kicked his ass, and then he had to wait until his little sorceress stuck an icicle in our chest to gloat. The douche. But yeah, we will get even with him. He's going down, I can assure you that. Okay. Fell asleep again. Ah, uh, see, these are the questions I wanted to know the answer to. Guardmaster Norg, who is this guy? He's a supposed master of the guard, and yet I've lived here all my life and never heard of this guy? Yeah, and what happens if he starts something up again, and there's another conflict, and everybody's fighting? I can't let that happen. We're going to have to stop this guy. But, although this is going to be a short episode, sorry guys, we're going to have to do that next time, because what happens after this is just a big conundrum of stuff, like always. And uh, there's a convenient save point here, so I'm going to save... And in the next episode, we'll go figure out what's going on with Norg, what this is all about. But we can rest easy knowing that the garden is safe, we avoided the missiles, and uh, I guess that's really it. I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.